Warning, this video may cause you to leave a like or even subscribe. Please, don't stop yourself. Android for life, yeah! What's up, people? This is Fluffy Bunny, Beaver Android, and today I'm gonna show you guys how to control your Xbox through your Android device. This app just came out recently, not too long ago, but not a lot of people know about it. And you control your whole Xbox through your phone, you get some game features that let's say you're playing uh, Forza Horizon, you get the map over here for the game and like Dance Central, you get, you know, this stuff on here. It's pretty cool. You get more features and it's all free. I'll show you guys that I'm using this controller. I'm going to take out the battery. There's nothing connected to the Xbox right now. You get the app Xbox Smart Glass. I'll have a link for it down in the description. So you take it and then once you take it, you just log into your Xbox Live account that you have logged in and you just wait for it to sign in. Now it just said signed in, it's connecting and then it should say connected. Yeah, right there. It says YouTuber here connected with Xbox Smart Glass. Obviously, it's my gamer tag. And then once you get connected, you're going to find this option right here. It's called play. You just click it. It's in the front page. Now it's going to show kind of like the Xbox controller. You got the B button, the Y, the X. The A button is when you tap it. And then your navigation is just up, down, left, right. So you go right, left, and then you can go down. You see that I'm selecting this. Go up. And then if you do want to type, you can use your phone to type. So you go down, click it, and then it comes up with the keyboard to type. And then let me search Android. Okay, so I typed Android there. It's white, so you can't really see it. Let me zoom in right there. It says Android. It's really cool, and you have this, uh, so you press X to get out of it. And then you got this button right here. You can go to uh, quick settings like browser and stuff. You can even control the uh, Xbox internet browser with this. It's really cool. You use this as a mouse pad. So you, click, you can click guide. It brings out the guide button. And then you can go through like your friends list and stuff. So let me go up first. Okay, so let me go right. And then I'm going to type a message for someone using my phone. It's really cool and quick. So I'm just take add text. So it comes up with this and then you see I'm typing here. It's typing over here. It's really cool. This is like an amazing feature. I think this is going to get really, really popular in the future. It's going to be a, like in a lot of games, extra features, stuff like that. And on the app itself, you can go through like games and stuff like that. So let's say you're looking at a, you got, you got this discover page over here. Let's say you found a rock band through, you want to look at it. You see right there, it says play on Xbox. You click play on Xbox. It plays straight right away on your Xbox right there. It's really cool. It takes you straight to the game. And see if I, if I hold my finger like this, it goes all the way really fast. So I do recommend this app if you have Xbox Live. If you guys want to add me on Xbox, my gamer tag is YouTuber here, just like that. And we can play some Halo 4 together. I did not forget about the contest. I haven't really posted it because I mean it's not as serious because I mean only two people got. I got like seven submissions, but two people really made it in because they showed their face. The rest of the people, the rest of the people didn't really show their face. So I mean that's not really entering because I said you have to show your face. So two people won. I might give one thirty dollars, one twenty dollars, or just ten ten. So I'm not sure yet. So yeah, please make sure to check back. Android for life. Peace.